Welcome to our channel, English with NS. Hi guys, hope you are fine. In this video, we will learn the use of modal verbs might or may. Might is generally used when there is a little chance of something happening. In other words, it is used to express less possibility or when we are not sure about something. For example, she might sell her dresses. This might be true. There is a little difference between may and might. Level of certainty decides whether to use may or might. For example, if you are talking about the weather forecast and there is a chance of rain, you can use both, may or might, according to following situations. It may rain. If there is a 70% chance of rain. It might rain. If there is a 40% chance of rain. So, in this video, we will discuss the use of might in detail as we have already discussed the detailed use of may in our previous video. Might can express a possibility in the past, a possibility in the present or future. In past, might is followed by have. In present or future, might is followed by be. For example, he might have gone to school. You might have left your sunglasses in the hotel room. Dr. John might be available on 28th. Your interview might be postponed. Now, we will discuss the use of might in case of suggestion. We can also use might to give advice or suggesting something. It should be polite. It should be less direct. For example, imagine a situation. You are in a restaurant. You call a waiter and ask for a menu. Waiter gives you a menu card and politely suggests you something delicious. He will say, you might like to try our delectable soup. Here, the waiter is behaving very polite while suggesting you to try something new. Let's imagine a second situation. You are planning to shift into a new apartment. For this, you want to buy new furniture. You ask your friend for suggestion and share some ideas with her. She suggests that. It might be wise to do some more research before you finalize something. Use of might in conditional sentences. Might can also be used to express the possibility of happening something as a result of another event. Example for past tense. I might have passed the law exam if I had studied harder. I did not study harder so, I failed. If I had worked harder I could have passed the exam. Example for future tense. If it's sunny, I might go to the beach tomorrow. Tomorrow, I am thinking of going to the beach but it depends on weather. If the weather is good, it's possible that I will go. In this video, we have learned the difference of using may and might. Plus we discussed the detailed use of might in different situations. In our next videos, we will discuss the remaining model verbs with examples. Until then, goodbye. Thanks for watching. If you liked our video, please like, subscribe and also press the bell icon. Plus, don't forget to comment and share.